Welcome to the Smarkets integration video. This video will show you what Smarkets integration is, how to link your Smarkets account to your OddsMonkey account, how to place a bet using Smarkets integration, and how to overcome any error messages you may encounter. What is Smarkets integration? OddsMonkey and Smarkets have joined forces and developed the first matched betting tool that means bets can be placed directly at the Smarkets exchange without needing to leave OddsMonkey or even log into Smarkets. The integration will save a huge amount of time compared with previous versions of Odds Matcher. You'll no longer need to flick between screens to place your lay bets at Smarkets, and if the odds change, all of the calculations will automatically update, rather than you needing to manually input the data. Although we don't necessarily advocate ARBing, we're aware that people use Odds Matcher to make money using this method. The Smarkets integration will have a massive benefit here, due to the speed you are able to place lay bets. Linking your OddsMonkey account to Smarkets. On your OddsMonkey dashboard, you'll see the section Smarkets Settings. It's easy to link your Smarkets account to OddsMonkey. There are just a couple of quick steps. First, click the Link Your Smarkets Account button. Read through the information on the screen, and once you're happy, click Link to Smarkets Now to be taken directly to the Smarkets login page. Once you're on Smarkets, you'll need to enter your Smarkets username and password. You'll then see a standard Smarkets integration message screen requesting the authorization for OddsMonkey to place bets on your behalf. To authorize the integration, click Approve. That's it, your account will now be linked. You'll be shown your Smarkets account name, account status, whether it's linked or not, your Smarkets balance, and an editable Smarkets commission box. This is set at 2%, but if you have a lower commission rate, you can lower that to the correct percentage for you. You'll be able to change this at any time and we'll show you how to do that later on in this video. You can choose to have a confirmation message pop up before you place each bet on Smarkets by leaving the Display Confirmation box checked. Once you're happy, click Save Changes. Back on your dashboard, you'll see that your Smarkets settings box will now be filled in. Clicking the Refresh button will update your Smarkets balance, taking into account any bets which have settled since the last refresh. You can return to your settings at any time by clicking Smarkets Settings. If you want to unlink your account, just click the relevant button in Smarkets Settings. Placing bets using Smarkets integration. Currently, you'll only be able to place your bets directly from the Odds Matcher. However, we'll be extending this to all OddsMonkey tools in the coming months. Once you open up the calculator for your selected match, you'll be faced with all of the relevant information for your bet. As always, you can change between the bet types at the top of the calculator and the calculations will automatically be updated. Change your bet stake to the value of your back bet. Once you're happy with all of the calculations and you've placed your back bet with the bookmaker, you just need to click the Lay the Bet button and the bet will automatically be placed. If you have Display Confirmation ticked in your Smarkets settings, you'll see a message asking are you sure you want to place the lay bet? Just click Yes. If you've unchecked the box in your settings, the bet will be placed automatically when you click the button. When you've placed your lay bet, the button to place the lay will turn green. This is to avoid you double clicking the button and placing the lay bet twice. If you do wish to place another lay on the same event, simply click Lay Again. When bringing in the odds from Smarkets Exchange, Odds Matcher only recognises odds which have a minimum liquidity of £10. If we look at the example here on Smarkets Exchange, we can see that the horse Red Avenger has under £1 available to lay at odds of 6.6. .6. This would not show on Odds Matcher as it is under the £10 threshold. Odds Matcher would show the odds of 7.6 as this has over £10 liquidity. If we were to place a bet where this was the case, then obviously the better lay price of 6.6 .6 would be taken first, making it a better match for us and thus reducing the total liability. Error messages. There may be situations where you're unable to place a bet and this section of the video will look at the messages you may see on screen. 
One thing to note is that you should never get a partially matched bet laying the bet from odds matcher. The bet will either fully match or not match at all. The following are the messages you may come across using the Smarkets integration. You need to add funds to place this bet with Smarkets. This means that there isn't enough money available in your Smarkets exchange account to cover the liability for this bet. If this is the case, the Deposit at Smarkets button will be displayed. Clicking it will take you directly to Smarkets to deposit further funds should you wish. There may not be enough money at the exchange. If this message is displayed, it means that there isn't enough money available at the lay price to place your lay bet. If this is the case, either reduce your bookmaker stake if possible or look for another match. Odds have changed. The calculator has been updated accordingly. Please review it. There are two instances where you may see this message. The first will be if you open up the calculator and the Smarkets Exchange odds have changed from what was stated on Odds Matcher. Click OK and all of the calculations will be updated. The second time you might see this message is when you have the calculator open and go to place the lay bet. If the odds have changed at the Smarkets Exchange in the time you've had the calculator open, you'll see the Odds Have Changed message when you go to place your lay bet. Again, the calculator will automatically readjust to the correct lay odds and all the calculations will be updated. To recap what we've done in this video, we have explained what Smarkets integration is, along with its benefits, how to link your Smarkets account to your OddsMonkey account, how to place a bet using Smarkets integration, what potential error messages you may encounter when placing a bet. If you've got any questions about this, just swing by the community where our support team and other OddsMonkey members are waiting to help.